it is time for more Prey, everybody. Thank you for joining me again. We're way down here at what I'm going to call the bottom of the guts. And we found this terminal at the end of the last episode. And um, I'm not really sure I understand what it's for or what this is all about. Message here that says cargo processing in the event of malfunction, the cargo processing system requires manual reactivation. The system must be activated from both guts and cargo bay within eight minutes. Otherwise, the system must be reactivated. Well, first of all, I guess I don't know what the cargo processing system is, nor do I know, um, is it malfunctioning at the moment? I mean, I guess it is. I mean, you know, we've got cargo there, right? That's cargo. And it looks like there's a door here that uh, may open up. And if that's the case, well, then maybe we could get down in there and we could get some goodies. But, well, I need to watch out. Get hit by that thing. Uh, but, um, it looks like we have to do something from both ends maybe at the same time because we had received an email or we, we we read an email if we look at our inventory here and our data tab and we look at uh, email we get this email from ash to edward and he said okay edward i am positioned here in cargo bay once i execute the cargo processing command on this end we will have a limited time to activate it on your side in guts and that's where we are. We're in guts, I believe. That should re-establish the cargo transit. Thank you for helping me with this. Next time I promise I will not forget my transcribe. I'm not really sure what his transcribe has to do with anything. And then he says, makes a comment. I swear I had it with me this morning. It's like it just grew legs and walked away or something. So. That to me tells me that, you know, we have to do something on this end while somebody else does something on the other end, but what confuses me, I'm easily confused, is that right here, it looks like we could activate guts processing and cargo pro bay processing at the, from the same terminal. So, activating, guts processing, activation successful, oh, okay, and look, now there's a timer, eight minutes, trouble processing, so we've got a new objective here. I located a cargo processing workstation at the airlock between Cargo Bay and Guts. There appears to be a lot of cargo trapped in the space between, and the processing system is offline until the system is re reactivated in both Guts and Cargo Bay. Once I complete the process, I can open the airlock door in Guts and access the cargo. So, yeah, I guess this thing is telling me that now we need to go to Cargo Bay to do the other part. Because uh, if we hit OK and I do activate cargo bay, it says must activate cargo bay. Okay. So I guess really we have the same terminal in both locations. So there's both active or both um, options in both locations. Well, I'm not going to try to get to cargo processing in eight minutes. Not right now. We'll worry about that later. We have other work to do. What is that other work? Well... I was hoping that we could find this dude out here. Find Josh Dalton. We're going to turn this off. I was hoping we could find Josh Dalton. But in the last episode... It seemed to have... Lost where he is. I, I mean, I know in a, in a previous episode... We had a, uh, a marker... At least telling us which direction and which direction to go. But that marker is gone now. Or at least... If it's here, I, I don't see it. So, I don't really know where to go to find this dude now. And to tell you the truth, I'm not even sure how... Oh, actually, Cargo Bay's right there, isn't it? Huh. For some reason, I was thinking Cargo Bay was going to be, like, on the other end of this place. I mean, do I just want to go into Cargo Bay now? I don't know, man. Well, this is kind of the way I'm going, it looks like. Security locker. I don't, I don't know if I want to do this. Oh, it says it's locked. There's goodies in there. Locked. 
Here's Cargo Bay. This will take me into Cargo Bay. Um, yeah, I don't... Okay, I, I don't want to do that right now. I, I, I try to stay focused on one thing at a time. We'll worry about this later. What I want to know is, where's this Josh dude? That's what I want to know. We've got some cystoids here that we need to take care of. And... I can't remember, did we take care of the weaver last time? I don't remember whether we did or not. Okay, I'm starting to remember how I ended up here. So, I was wondering how I was going to take care of these cystoids. And I saw this explosive canister here. I figured I might be able to use that. But, um... Here's a piece of uh, equipment here. Not equipment. Um, storage equipment. That we need uh, level 4 hacking to get into. All that talk I did uh, in the last couple episodes ago about having level 4 hacking and how I haven't seen many opportunities to uh, use level 4 hacking. Well, there you go. There's an opportunity right there. And I still haven't decided whether to get up level 4 hacking or not. <laughs> um... What was that noise? Oh, that's that thing flying by. So. Well, I know we're going to come back here because we're going to go down here again. So I'll worry about this thing later. The time being... Let's see if I get my bearings here. I'm going to grab this. And I'm going to throw it in the direction of the cystoids and see if I can dispatch them this way. I don't know if I can or not. We're going to give it a shot. Let's see what happens. Boy, I feel like I'm moving really slow, and I am. But I don't want to get too out of control here. Alright, cystoids. So, how do I want to do this? Well, that wasn't too bad. Oh. Oh, well, we got rid of all of them but one. Oh, there's that damn weaver. He's still out there. The weaver's still out there. Boy, I really wish that we had the marker telling me where Josh is. But we don't. Okay, he did. So we got that weaver over there still. What's going on in here? Good grief, look at this place. Can't quite see what's going on because of all this coral in the way. And that's it's kind of weird looking down there how blue it is. There's something... Man, there's some weird stuff going on down there. And... Man, I mean, have we been here already? I don't even know. I figured we had. This is the way we... came here, isn't it? Oh no, here's, um... Okay, here we go. There's the shuttle bay where we just were. Fuel storage. Let's get out our, uh... Q-beam. Okay, he sees me. It's going to get hairy here in just a moment. I need to get closer to him. Wait, what's my range on this thing? Is he running away from me? No, he's not. I'm waiting for my crosshairs to turn red. Oh boy, I'm getting swarmed by cystoids. Am I even hitting this guy? Huh, okay. Well, I hit F5 right before I did that. That was kind of a test run. I kept waiting for my crosshairs or whatever to turn red to indicate that I was within range. But uh, they never did turn red. What did they just do? Oh, that must have been... Okay, I hit my right mouse button <laughs> thinking it, I would aim. <laughs> there's, no, there's no aiming in this game. Whoa! Whoa. Holy cow, here they come. 
Why am I doing no damage to him at all? Where'd he go? I don't seem to be doing any damage to this weaver. I don't quite understand that. Huh. Um... Yeah, I'm, uh... Confused here. Weaver's still over there. Whoa, what was that? What was that thing that just showed up? Did you see that? That was like... What was that? Something... Looked like my suit was trying to zoom in on something. Here's another explosive thing. Uh, I rem I seem to... Let's see. Weaver's... Research... Weavers are weak to null waves and psycho shock. Well, don't know if that's going to do me any good right now. Can I get, can I open this? Get this stuff. I, mean, I don't know if this is going to do anything to him or not. But I'm just kind of experimenting here. He didn't like that. He didn't like that at all. I'm coming for you. Where'd he go? Um. Take some health here. Where are you, baby? Now I need to survive this. These cystoids. Oops. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Did I get him? I think we got him. It was messy. And probably pretty expensive. But... I think I got him. Oh. Trouble processing. Oh, okay. So... Yeah, it's telling me that I missed my opportunity, I think. Yeah. Um. Thought I'd seen something else over here. So, where is the. Um. Oh, wait a minute. I saw a marker show up. What the heck? I saw it and then I. There it is. Whoa, it's right there. Oh, that's the processing thing. I thought I turned that off. Off, please. I don't need that on at the moment. So now I want to find the remains of the weaver so I could loot him. Is this what's left of the weaver here? Uh, it doesn't really say, but I'm going to guess that's it. Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sheesh. I, uh, ooh, boy, I tell you, I am having a hell of a time getting my bearings here. Okay. So here's a platform that we could stand on. Um... Yeah, man, I don't know where to find this Josh guy at all. What's up down there? Is there still more dangerous stuff down here? Oh, no, that's just something else. I, I don't even know which way I'm facing right now. Or in which direction I should be going. <laughs> Jeez, this is so confusing. Uh, okay, so the shuttle bay is that way. So I think that means we want to go this way? Maybe? I don't know, man. It's this right here. Okay, nothing in that. Huh. I am really confused as to why we had a marker for Josh before, but we don't now. Don't really know why that is. Oh, radioactive. Uh, look at this. Let's get my bearings here. 
Shuttle Bay and Cargo Bay are to my right. Psychotronics and the Arboretum are to my left. But where's Josh? I'm telling you, man, we had a marker for him before. Where did it go? I, mean, I just don't know. I remember it, it was somewhere around here. And I do not understand. Turn it off. Cystoid? Where's the cystoid? Man, there's more cystoids? I don't mess with more cystoids. Well, shoot. Just a moment ago, I saw more explosives. What's that over there? I don't know, that's probably where I just was. down here. Here's an explosive oxygen bottle. I don't know whether I've been here before or not. Oh, that thing's um, radioactive, isn't it? This thing right here. Yeah. There were a bunch of cystoids there, but I took care of them. Uh, and there's some goodies over there, but they're probably a little too close to... That thing. Oh, look at it moving around now that I shot it. Holy hell, this place is confusing. So if I turn this back on... Find Josh Dalton in the guts. I mean, maybe I need to get close enough to him to activate this thing or something? I don't know, man. I know I keep saying the same thing over and over again, but we saw, we saw him before. I don't know if this will work against these cystoids or not, but I'm going to go ahead and pick it up. I'll take it with me back here into this opening here. See if I can throw it at these cystoids. See if it helps or anything, I don't know. I can't quite tell where they are exactly. Are they in this tube? Or are they on the other side of it? Can't quite tell where they are. Or how to get to them. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that's just that radioactive thing on the other side of this. Hopefully it won't affect us in here. I'm pretty sure I went through here before, didn't I? Shish, what in the world is this place? Where are those cystoids? They're over there somewhere. How do I get over to where they are? Man, I do not know. They are like in a, a different tunnel or something, and I don't think this map is going to help me. So, I guess, yeah, there's another tunnel over here, but I don't know how to get to it. What does this mean here? So here's fuel storage. We know that place. How do I get to this tunnel? Looks like I should be able to get to it from here, but maybe not. Maybe I need to get to it from... Oh, here's Magnetosphere. We've been over here already. Remember, there was that medical bay we couldn't get into. So, it's like we've already been in this tunnel. I get this stupid thing in my face. Oh, I just have to get rid of it. It's in my way. Boy, I don't know what the hell I'm doing here. I just don't know. Where's this going to take me? 
So here we are again at the bottom of this place. Well, maybe I will go into cargo. I don't know. Let's just go ahead and do this. This is something I feel like maybe I could do. Okay. And then we'll put this objective back on. And I'm going to go into the cargo bay. Just because I don't know what else to do. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm going in here. Cargo bay. Why not? Why not into the cargo bay? Maybe there'll be a way into that other tunnel. Maybe we'll find Josh. I'm reaching here. Michael gravity detected. Okay, so. No idea what to expect in this place. Hey, look, a suit repair kit, which you know what? I could actually use right now. Let's bring up our inventory here. And we'll use two of those to get our suit up to maximum health. Talos 1. Why does that look so weird? I don't know. <laughs> I have a feeling that... Oh, wait a minute. I have two things here. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe that's the other end of trying to, ac uh, trying to activate processing. Um, I have a feeling it's going to take me longer to get here than I'd like. go now. Where's my marker? Oh gosh, look at this place. That's the other one. Oh, I could carry some cargo. Whoa! Oh crap. Well, there's trouble. Let's go ahead and mark this guy. Try to, anyway. Oh shoot. He's in a hurry. So is there glass between us and him, or can he totally see us? Where the hell's my other marker? Where'd it go? I only see this one. Where's the other one? Over here. Normal gravity detected. Whoa. <laughs> I'm so confused. What the? A etheric phantom. Come, don't be so shy. Don't be shy. Come on, I want to scan you. Oh, he saw me. Damn it. Oh, hell. Oh, crap. He's right in front of my freaking face. Oh, that's not my shotgun. Damn it. Uh. I need to take some health. And then, uh. Switch my shotgun. I think I got him. Did I get him? I got him. Okay. Woohoo! Going through the health kits. Let's eat some of this food. I got a lot of it. <laughs> I took care of him. It was messy, frantic, but it worked. It worked. Sheesh. Look at all the goodies he's got on him. Okay. I have four and a half minutes to get to processing. So I'm just going to kind of run through here quicker than I normally would. Now we're over there? What the hell did I... Alright. Walked right past it. What is it saying here? It says, um, cargo transfer doors malfunction. Reactivation required cargo stalled inside. 
activate cargo bay processing. Is this what I need to do? I hope this is it. Activation successful. Okay. Well, I don't know what I activated. But now I need to open the cargo door. Multiple objectives in that direction. Again, I don't know why I'm doing this. Microgravity detected. But I'm going to do it, and then we'll explore this place. Multiple objectives in this direction. Now, I don't think there's a timer for this one. Oh, man. Can't go through that door. How did I get in here? Um... How the hell did I get in here? <laughs> Through here, maybe? Oh, damn it. Hello? What the heck? Is there... Oh, there's a wall here. Or a glass, a glass wall. Okay. That I ran into. Oh, oh, there's another one here. Oh, good lord. This is annoying. They come in this way? Is this how I got in here? Ugh, it's not. Alright. How did I get in here and how do I get out? Oy. Is there glass here? There is. Okay, this is getting annoying. So there's a door there. I can't get through. What the hell? Um, there's a door here. That also isn't going to open. Um, holy hell! Door, door. How the hell did I get in here? Multiple, multiple objectives, 28 meters in that direction. Oh, wait a minute. I came in through this, didn't I? Aha, here we go. Here we go. This is the way I came in. Okay. I'm still not 100% sure this is... Yep, yeah, okay. Supposed so to go this way. So now we go back out here. <laughs> what am I doing, man? What is this for? Microgravity detected. Okay. Now we're going to go back this way. Now what? Now... I want to open the cargo door from this panel here, I guess. Activation successful. Open cargo door. Okay, opening cargo door. Cargo door open. Okay. Yay. Whoa. And... Okay, well. There you go. Cargo door opens. Hooray. Why did I want to open the cargo door? I don't know. Get it some cargo, I guess. Alright, what's with the weird sound effects? <laughs> well, we can get into this box. Whoops. Typhon lure. And, um... thought I saw a box with a... lock on it. Oh my gosh. I'm getting so confused. Here we go, this right here. 
error. This is a, uh... Ooh, let me get my bearings here. This is a level two. All right, let's open it. That's what we're doing, man. We're just nosing our way into everything. Get around. Ugh, I'm all... shook up from all that weirdness we just went through. <laughs> Point seven eight seconds left. Okay, I opened it. And inside, what do we get? Huh. A couple crates, expired plasma bag, and a petri dish sample. Don't know why they're shipping that. Psy hypo and a suit repair kit. Okay, great. Alright, well, we got some goodies from that. But um, that sure seemed like an awful lot of work. Just to get in here, right? Like a lot of work. So here's what appears to be another door here, but um, I guess this one isn't going to open. And it doesn't look like there's anything on the other side of it. And then over here. Yeah, another door that doesn't go anywhere, it looks like. So, there's a cargo box that's opened. This is the one that we probably opened from the other side. I guess. This is kind of weird. Okay, I mean, it's... seemed like an awful lot of work for relatively small reward. Uh, I'm left wondering if there's really any more to it than this. It hasn't opened up any opportunities for me, you know, to find uh, Josh. Pretty sure I still have that activated. I do indeed. So, um... Yeah. Not the most exciting thing, got to tell you. Well, I mean, we could go back into that cargo bay and explore it. Bullets and Q beam cells. Nice, Q beam cells, man. Yeah, bullets and Q beam cells. That's the kind of stuff I'm looking for. That's what I want to see. Q beam cells, I still don't know how to fabricate those. Okay, well, I guess I'll leave the cargo bay now. So, cargo processing. Do I need to do something else on this? Why is this showing up as a thing? Nope, no other options. Okay. We could uh, go ahead and dispense uh, um, operator. Ah. I'm gonna have to hack into it though, that sucks. Fine. I'll hack into it. Let me through. Oh, come on now. Oh crap, I screwed up. Oh, damn it. Ah. Ugh. Oh boy, this one looks way worse than the one we just did. Yeah, this one sucks. Ugh. Oh hell. Ah, hell. Alright, screw it. I, I don't want an operator that bad. I just thought I'd do it since I was here, but I don't want it that bad. Talk about sour grapes, right? Okay, well, I mean, I guess we'll go into the cargo bay. I don't really know why I want to, but uh, it's here. And it looks interesting, so I'm going to go in it. Um, are these things still locked? They are. Don't know how to get into them.
Don't see anything broken. So I guess this is gonna, just another case where I have to imagine that we need to be a Typhon to get in there. You know, we have to have the Typhon ability that will allow us to get small. So I'm just going to make that assumption. Which kind of sucks because I like to think that there's multiple ways to do things. See, there's a button on this side to press. There are buttons on this side. Okay, well there you go. You wanted multiple ways to do things, you got it. Now I just need a way to shoot my bolt through there. What is this stuff? Let's see how good of a shot I am. Damn good one, apparently. It's so secure. Huh. Like floating around. Okay, well, we're in. A safe. Q-beam cells. Nice. Spare parts. Cool. Boy, this, these things are nondescript. I just happened to point my weapon in the direction of that thing. Psy hypo is boring. I say boring because I really have no use for psy hypos. So I guess, I guess really I do if I start using com combat focus. Then I'll have a use for them. Well, um... I don't know, man. Let's go back into the cargo bay. I kind of hate to do that, though, because... Again, I, I like... I would rather the game take me there. You know, I'd rather the game be like, okay, you need to go to the cargo bay to do something, you know. But the game's not taking me here. At least not yet. Right now, you know, find Josh Dalton. He's out here in the guts somewhere. And then um, everything else takes place in crew quarters. Except for these drop points here. But yeah, Arboretum. Crew quarters, crew quarters. And if we look at our map, we'll see... Um, we have to get to the Arboretum before we go to crew quarters. So here's Cargo Bay. Which will take us into life support and the power plant. And I, I just... I just can't help but think that I shouldn't be here yet. And it's not that, not that I'm worried that the enemies are going to be too hard. It's just that, as I mentioned before in this playthrough, I kind of hate to go down here and fight and clear it all out, only to, you know, be told later on in the game to come back here again. And then the place may be populated at that time with more enemies, you know? So, I, I know I'm being wishy-washy. I'm not going to go in it right now. I'm not. I'm, I'm going to let the game take me there. I'm going to wait till I have a reason to go in there. But, still have the problem of where the heck is Josh Dalton? Where the hell are you, Josh Dalton? Where are you, my man? Shuttle Bay, we've already been in. That's where we just were. So, I mean, I guess I'm just going to fly around here and hope that we get a notification that we're near Josh. I mean, when we, remember when we went into the shuttle bay? When we were in the fuel storage room, there was a marker telling us where Josh was. Why is it gone now? Very disturbed by that. Oh, here's that radioactive stuff again. What can I do with radioactive stuff? I mean, I don't think I could destroy it. You know? This is gonna sit there and be annoying forever. I mean, I could get around it by going through here, right? So this this is just like a little shortcut around it. You can see the marker for it right there at the corner of the screen. So this is a 
path to get around it. But old Josh, where are you, buddy? How do I find old Josh? Pretty sure I already looked in here. Although... Yeah, okay, empty. There's more radioactive over there, see? Although a bunch of radioactive stuff right there. Crap. Um... Uh-huh. Well, now what? It's like... What's this pl Okay, this is just the same place. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> oh! Oh! This thing's alive! Crap! Um... Alright, we don't need to fight everything we see. Okay, this has already been searched. Yeah, I'm getting lost again. Losing my bearings again. Well, there's that radioactive stuff. I guess I made it past it okay. There's that... cystoid. I don't think we're ever gonna find Josh. I don't think we are, man. That's how I'm feeling. I'm feeling like... I had one shot, and I blew it. There's a safety platform. This... Did somebody just see me? I think I'm going the wrong way. I am. This is the way we just came from. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the way I want to go, but there's radioactive stuff here. Try to get around it as quickly as possible. Okay. Alright, I made it past it. Now. Now I'm here. Here is maintenance tunnel. But this, this is going to take us... We've been through this tunnel, haven't we? Oh, brother. Um... Ah, oh, jeez. Maintenance tunnel and psychotronics. I think this is the way we came from. This is how we got in here. We came from that tunnel. Hey, where are you, engineering dude? Where are you? Where is he? I could use a suit patch up. Where'd you go, dude? I heard you. <laughs> Cannot see him for anything. Good grief. The Arboretum's th that way? Oh my gosh, man. Okay, here's the engineering operator right here. Let's get a quick suit patch up. Nice to see you not being all corrupt and stuff. Thank you. Arboretum is this way. Okay, so I believe yes, yes, I'm starting to get my bearings now, sort of. That is where we came from. That's the way to Psychotronics. We have not been this way yet. We have not been this way. What, what? Cystoids, man. Stupid annoying cystoids. They're just annoying. They're just annoying. There's all kinds of stuff to throw at them. Whoa! Something see me? Whoa! Weaver! Well, we got a freaking weaver over there now. The last time I fought one, I barely killed it. I mean, I could go ahead and throw this 
at the cystoids, but he's just going to make more of them. Right? Oh, crap. Man, I tell you what, that thing goes far. I throw it. Don't know if this will do anything to the weaver itself, though. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's a ton more cystoids. Oh, crap. Here they come. Is he actually running away from us? <laughs> kind of seems that way. I thought I'd marked him, but I guess not. Oh, God. Look at that place down there. Sheesh. Oh, boy. Anything here? This shaft. No? I don't know what the purpose of this is. Come to a stop. Turn around. Look around a little bit. Ay, ay, ay. All right, I'm going to pick this thing up. Stupid weaver coming down here. Messing this place up. Subsection 42, I don't know why that is mirrored. There's a operator there. How you doing there, dude? Good to see you. I read him's in this direction. I don't want you to get in, in the middle of this operator, okay? No, he sees me. See how far we can throw it. And... Oh, whoa! Whoa, what's the status I've got? Oh, hell! I didn't realize he was actually coming this way! <laughs> Q-beam. And I've got a status on me. Oh, it's gone now. But there was a weird status. It looked kind of scary. Maybe I was afraid. Uh, where is he? Ah, oh, yeah. Screw you, Weaver. Screw you. <laughs> yeah. I hate to use all my Q-beam ammo, but I don't know any other way to take those guys out. And I have to hope that sooner rather than later... We're going to find the Q-beam fabrication plans. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, we did that. We didn't take any damage to our person or to our suit. Well, I guess that was just upside down, wasn't it? When I looked at it, I thought it was mirrored, but it's not. It's just... Good lord, man. It's just upside down. This place has me so messed up. <laughs> Gosh. Oh my gosh. So confusing. Um, pretty sure I'm still going in the right direction. I mean, I, I'm just going towards Arboretum. Oh, Josh, man. I don't know where to find Josh. I don't know what happened to him. I really don't know. And I wouldn't mind if there was a sign somewhere. Letting me know which way I'm going. But, uh, not getting it. It's just right here, this little indention. Oh, just a window to outside? Yeah. Moon over there. Advertisement. Okay. Oh, I'm back to the tunnel again. I read him this way. I knew that. I knew that. Okay. Here we go. There's that operator. How you doing, buddy? It's good to see you. Friendly face out here. What's this over here? What is that? What is that? And why is my... Operator approach. What is that? What happened out here? 
Was this a cargo? This is Chief Engineer Illusion. What? The power plant has been compromised. I repeat, the power plant has been compromised. It's about time, Sam. Chief, I'm not a comm tech. I'm doing the best I can. Micah, this is Security Chief Elazar. Can you hear me? Sarah? Yes, I can hear you. Been trying to patch into the PA. My team's in the cargo bay, and those things are in here too. They're crawling all over the station. Check everything around you. Hit it with a wrench. Check the wrench first. Sam, he's right. These things, smash every freestanding thing and see if it comes back at you. Get to a secure area, and when you're safe, call me via transcribe. I'm sending you a secure contact, all right? Understood. I left my transcribe in the coolant monitoring station. <laughs> Heading there now. I can load myself in. Are you okay? I'm just catching my breath. Sarah, can you tell me what happened? Micah, get safe, then call. Well, what was all that? Is that just... Is that live? Is that happening right now? Because I we didn't pick up a recorder, a recording. We didn't pick up a transcribe. I mean... Did we just pick up on a broadcast from people who are still alive? Is that what happened? I think that's what happened. Eel scraps. So yeah, I'm going to guess that this cargo thing was transporting food. And um, it got spewed all over the place here. Okay, those I can't interact with. Okay, well, I'm going to end this episode here with that very peculiar message or radio transmission we just picked up so I could go back and watch it again before the next episode we come back next time I guess we'll keep making our way towards the Arboretum really bummed out that I can't seem to find old Josh uh, if anybody has any theories I mean don't tell me where he is but uh, has any theories am I doing something wrong is my game bugged did I miss my opportunity to get him um yeah, let me know. Alright, that's the end of this episode. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it.